is she dead? Oh no, is she dead? Did you... Greetings and salutations everyone. Welcome back to the channel. My name is Hafro and today we're watching Queen's Gambit episode 4. I just finished episode 3, so I'm not going to talk a whole lot about it. If you watch the reaction, you know that Beth lost her first match to Benny Watts. We've got some googly eyes between her and Kentucky Towns, and uh, that's about it, you know. Um, we're going to see what her chess life brings to her and what's going on with, uh, you know, hopefully we'll get to the mysterious death behind uh, her mother and see what exactly led to her adoption and and get to know more and i'm looking forward to seeing the conclusion of the show so episode four let's jump into it as always if you enjoy the reaction please make sure to leave a like and subscribe to the channel that's real easy and free and you can do it by clicking that little notification bell to let you know when i upload uh, my schedule is kind of weird so best way to know when my episodes go live is by punching that bell and you can also follow me on my socials at uh, Twitter and Instagram at HalfRowThunder. And I stream on Twitch at twitch.tv slash HalfRowThunder. We play a lot of cool games over there, so come on over, send me a follow, and uh, we'll come join the chat and we'll talk. So um, without further ado, let's jump into the reaction. On Lubin. On. Is she taking Russian classes? So night classes for Russian at the local community college or junior college or whatever. She started doing them. Cool. Beth Nimrod, what are you doing? You know, like right now. Drugs, apparently. U.S. Women's Champion. U.S. Open Co. Champion. <laughs> okay, so they did share the championship. Nah, too cerebral. Played a lot of Monopoly though. Again. <laughs> mm, don't. It makes you a slave to capitalism. <laughs> Jeez. Uh, this guy's got hippie written all over him. Bedroom through the kitchen. Mm, I don't like this guy. He's also no offense to the actor, but not as good looking as some of her other romantic options in the show. Let's be honest. That. I'm um, um okay. That that is that is a. Um, we all know what that is. I'm gonna, probably going to have to blur, blur that out, but it's a, a phallus candle. We'll just call it that, a phallus candle. Did you say you're partying with college students? Yep. <laughs> is that a waterbed that you just sat on? It sounded like a waterbed. Oh, that's a weird looking can. Please do not hook up with this guy. He should not be your first time. Ugh. Tell me. <sighs> She's not having fun. Just. Uh, mm. How much longer? Oh no. Mm. Why? <sighs> okay, that just happened. <laughs> uh, oh, and then he just passes out. Jeez, bro. She stayed the night, huh? Your mom's gonna be furious, hopefully. Let's hope she's furious. God knows I would if you were my child. You just leave this random person in your place? Oh, okay. <laughs> Here, here's a, here's a toke to get you through the day. She made herself at home. <laughs> Eggs and beer. Is she cleaning up for them? That's too nice. Too nice. She went to the store and got more alcohol for them. Wow. Wait. How? Did they not card her? Is she trying on other people's clothes? So I won't be home for <sighs> Tell her no. Tell her no. Tell her to come home. I had a good time. No, you that you you looked bored. Yeah. 
Is she finding the alcohol can get her into the trance that looks just like the tranquil uh, drug scan? Hey, she graduated. <laughs> hey, at least her mom's happy. That's, that's like my mom in my graduation. She'd totally be that mom. She wouldn't be that mom, though. She wouldn't give me alcohol. Fancy. Is that supposed to mean something? Like a Rolex? With love. Oh, It's perfect. It's gonna make me tear up. I love it. Oh, are they skipping to Another flying Saturday. to Paris? Or no. I mean, they, they probably gotta fly other places. Because we haven't seen the US Championship yet. Never. I have to say, I am really quite thrilled. <laughs> not nervous? What does guy not look anything like that picture? Are they going to Mexico early? I suppose so. Oh, they're going to Mexico. City. Ugh. <laughs> <laughs> uh, what's gonna happen between those two? I could honestly care less about any subplot with a mother besides her being a mother to Beth. Because <laughs> I care more about Beth becoming a champion. I don't, I don't know. Maybe I just am selfish about just this being about chess instead of anything else. But I mean, I do still want to learn about Beth's uh, backstory and her mom. But I had lunch and dinner every day this week. I'm pretty sure they're fucking. <laughs> I think you just don't like men well. <laughs> well, yes. Play chess well, but I am convinced that relaxation can only improve them. What's she gonna do? Oh, she went with them, okay. She's having a grand old time. What it costs. Hard to say for you what that will be. Yeah, she's definitely becoming some kind of an alcoholic. I mean, at the very least, I'm pretty sure legal age was, what, 18 in Mexico for drinking? So, who were those guys? Oh, wait, is that the, is that the Russian? It looks like the guy from that picture. Wow, what a crazy random happenstance. Oh, there's that cough. Kentucky, Elizabeth Harmon. Uh, at least her hair is getting a little bit cuter. <laughs> that that's a scary face that she's got right there. That's an interesting clock. He looks terrified out of his mind. <laughs> I wonder where you would listen to this, like, play-by-play -play of these championships. No, stay and study him. Study him. Okay. Did he have his fun and then let her go and she's all sad now? Never been to Oaxaca. I imagine it resembles Denver. <laughs> Good, yes. Was that the young boy that was with the Russian like? Or is that an older child, I, I believe? Maybe like a protege of the Russian? See, I do think that the, the thing about chess these chess games that they were representing on the table are being played much faster time than a normal chess game uh, would normally be played. Like, they're making their moves super fast, which sometimes can happen, but in a lot of games, especially when you have, like, you know, 90 to 120 minutes to play, they're making their decisions with a lot more thought into it and taking more time, I believe. See, look at that. The sun's gone down. It's been five hours. Five hours? 
Oh, is this like an exhibition match? Does it? I would dig that. <laughs> uh. Oh, okay. It sounds like he was trying to invite her to a drive it or something, but he's just not. Miss Dorman, I would like to invite you to the drive-in movies to see Elizabeth, uh, to see the Elvis Presley. <laughs> that must have been an exhibition match and not like part of the tournament, but man, a five-hour game? Holy cow. They had a whole night to think about the board and their moves. I imagine she's just wanting to stretch her legs during the game because they played five hours already. <laughs> is he gonna start getting angry now? Who is this child? <laughs> I'm so confused. Well, that's just annoying. Don't do that, Beth. You're the best I've ever played. Wow, that's a strong compliment coming from her. <laughs> yeah, until you play Borgo, that's right. Oh, ooh. <gasps> oh. She's got a plan. Ooh, I wasn't I wasn't expecting her to be playing uh uh I don't know if it's if that's if he's the Russian or if uh just a champion Russian like this early in in the show. I thought it was gonna be like in France or something. That uh, those Russian glasses are uh, gonna come in, in handy. Ooh, I'm excited. Let's get into this game. Must be a, a Russian thing that they kind of have to have their pieces all set, maybe, or just like a. Uh, him and like maybe his protege was that child and they kind of have that kind of court to them Or maybe everyone does that. I don't know I... Pull... Pulled out the queen Don't get scared Beth you can do this come on uh Oh is it is it the end of the game for her? Her mom's not there. <sighs> I'm sure if her mom were there, she'd have some, you know, moral support and she'd be able to do it, but... Or maybe she's just gonna be like, screw it, I'm on my own, I've always been on my own, and... I'm just gonna finish this game on my own. And the whole time he looks bored. <laughs> I'm so glad you didn't see it. Oh, is she dead? Oh no, is she dead? Did she commit suicide? Or did she just die in her sleep? Or what? Oh. Dang it. You know, she's had two moms die on her. Again, I'm very sorry for your loss. And now she's going to dive deeper into her addictions. She's dead. She died this morning. Oh, the adoptive father. The house is yours. Just make the mortgage payments. Mm -hmm. House is hers. What a horrible dude. Horrible dude. That's a large hotel. Wow. Mouse. <laughs> well, that was a very depressing episode to watch. Uh, I mean, she beat the child prodigy. I, I must have missed something in the episode that said she was going to do an ex exhibition match or something. I might have to go back and rewatch it. Um, but yeah, five plus hour match, that's crazy. Um, 
Obviously, she lost to the Russian, um, their first match. I imagine she'll probably play him again once or twice. Obviously, I believe the Paris um, showdown that we saw the very first episode, I believe, is uh, the big thing. It's probably going to be the, <laughs> the big battle at the end of the series, and she was drugged up and woke up late and all that stuff in that episode. So, obviously, she's going to start going down this crazy spiral of drugs and alcohol I imagine now that her adoptive mother is gone because of the hepatitis which you know I said like bronchitis and something like that so it did, yeah that makes that, that makes a lot of sense so it's really sad to see and obviously her adoptive father is a jerk and uh at, fr at first when when uh, she said it's your daughter I I thought she was calling her actual real life dad um who I believe is still alive so I mean Maybe we'll see something from him down the line. I don't know. We'll see. I, we still don't know anything about uh, her mom's background, why she killed herself, tried to kill Beth, but uh, I'm hoping we get to see that towards the end. So uh, let me know what you thought of the episode down in the comments down below, and we'll see you with the next episode.